for a reason began when a group of educators returned from a trip to Haiti following the devastating earthquake of 2010. Knowing that recovery for a country was intended to build a better Haiti, we wondered what our part might be. Inspired by the dedication of teachers and school children we visited, it seemed right for us to embark on a mission to encourage continued education in rural Haiti, where fewer than 50% of children attend school and even fewer continue past the sixth grade. Our first mission was to provide tuition assistance for students who were in danger of ending their education, but our approach would be different. We would commit to individual students for the duration of their education, elementary, high school, and university. Our first student came to us through our coordinator in Haiti. The home of nine-year-old Schneider had been destroyed in the earthquake, and his mother's temporary shelter was located too far from the school for daily travel. Schneider's eagerness to learn was so spirited so not to miss a day of education, he slept here on the steps of his school. School is very important to me. I am the first in my family to attend a school like this. As For a Reason learned more about Schneider's family, we realized that a tent designed to provide temporary shelter for six months was still the only housing available for Schneider and his family four years after the earthquake for a reason made the decision to build the family a home. My mother was ill in the tent she was living in. I am very grateful for the house and for my family to be together again. We saw a family reunited. Joy returned to the face of a child and hope restored to a mother. We were also reminded that children who are frightened because of unsafe living conditions are challenged to perform at their best in school. Another student we sponsor is Elizabeth. Our house is very old. It is made with plaster and mud. Our floor and walls inside is dirt. I must use the solar lights given to us to complete my homework. For a Reason considers building projects to be part of our ongoing commitment to our students. Local realtors have supported us with this mission. With the sale of a home, a donation is made towards the building of a new home for one of our students. Soon, Elizabeth and her family will begin the building process of their new home. These homes are constructed to withstand severe tropical storms, boasting cement flooring, watertight construction, and wiring to allow electricity should it come to their area. Each home requires a $10,000 commitment. Not a lot by American standards, but life-changing to a Haitian child and her family. When board member Barbara Nuradine visited Haiti and met with students and teachers, she quickly recognized the need for food and nutrition, not only for our particular students, but all of the students who were attending the schools with them. Our schools are located in rural Haiti, where families are subsistence farmers and earn less than a dollar a day. Many of the students in this area are not simply hungry, they are quite literally starving. Food preparation areas, such as outdoor kitchens, also needed addressing. This kitchen under construction shows the need for a clean and sanitary environment. As a result of discussions with her husband, Mark Niradine, founder and president of Bull Outdoor Products, a decision to partner with us at FAR was made, making the Grill for Good program a company-wide effort. The specific mission of building outdoor kitchen areas for school lunch preparation and supplying the food necessary for those lunches has evolved to include Bull employees and distributors, both here and abroad. Already we are proud that one kitchen is completed. Another is in the planning stage, 
and a third will begin construction next year. These kitchens will not only help the preparation of school lunches, but will become community centers that generate an income for the school. It only takes the smile and look of contentment on the face of a hungry child to know the impact of this program. With supporters like you, for just one dollar and a half a day, a child can receive a nutritional meal, one that is prepared by local Haitians who are paid a fair wage. For $30, that child is served a lunch for an entire month. And for $300, that child will receive a lunch on every school day for the entire year. Thanks to the financial support of our partners, For a Reason makes a long-term commitment to our students for the duration of their education in primary, secondary, and university schools. Annual tuition for a primary student is $100. Keeping that same child in secondary school costs $250 annually. We are especially proud of Italy and are sponsoring her education at a nursing university. Her story is compelling, her smile infectious, and her determination one we had to support. Her intention has always been to complete the program and return to her isolated community where she will be the first provider of medical care ever. For universities is just under $4,000 annually. And this is why we appeal to our partners to give generously, to inspire and prepare a generation that will contribute towards building a better Haiti. We at For A Reason encourage you to join us in giving time, talents, and resources. Together we really can make a difference. One child, one family, one community at a time. We give of ourselves for a greater good. We must be here for a reason.